day of vacation. We are coming back to the same place we've been to two times already, where she got her personal best common carp and black carp, and I got my personal best grass carp and all the white bass and walleye. It's been the most good to us compared to all the other places, so we decided to hit this one time, one more time. Today's conditions are complete overcast with an inch of rain coming after dark today. It's not going to hit till about 10 o'clock tonight, so we're safe all day. It's very cold. It's 50 degrees right now, but it feels 30 because of, there's a light breeze. It's supposed to get 63, but I don't believe the Weather Channel's correct anymore. They've been wrong so many times lately. It's ridiculous. Uh, I'm going to try to get one of these black carp, and I want a big common carp also. I'm going to fish a lot with red wigglers. What we're going to do is fish with worms for two hours, and then journey down the creek about a mile fishing with lures, and then come back to that same hole in the evening so they'll unspook. Oh yeah, there we go. Oh man, I got something nice. Real nice. Big walleye. Wilma. All right, guys, yes. Real nice one for here. Oh man, he's 18. Oh man. I need you to... Will you come over here? Don't scare the fish. Man, that's a nice walleye, guys. On the Suicide Chad Barbie colored. 18 inch. My God, look at that. 18 incher. I need you to film me. Come on. Come here. What are you doing? No. Who knows anymore with you? Will you come over here? I'm gonna wash him off. <clears throat> Want you to show me, come here. big for here my god that's the biggest one of the year right here without a doubt come on I wanna man he is nice that's almost worth keeping that's a big one for sling creek Isn't that nice for here? That's like the ones we get out of the Black River. Oh my goodness. Well guys, I got off to a really good start. This wall I just made the day already. It's a nice 18 incher. Got him on the Suicide Shad Barbie with a pink and yellow VMC Moon Eye quarter ounce. Six pound Suffolk Siege line. I had a big old carp hooked with this swim bait, and then I missed a big 13 inch crappie, so this is a good sign. There you go, stick them fins up. Yeah, oh man, that's a nice walleye. Isn't it? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Put the over there, not put over there for not. Yeah. Going to pieces. Scared. Yeah. John will want it. Ah.
Yep. And it's cloudy. This is a pure walleye again. All right, guys, another walleye about a little 13 inch. I'm telling you, they love this Barbie suicide shad on a cloudy day with a pink and yellow jig head. It just, they love it. That's all I can say. That's two walleye, one species. Hey, that's a cool kind though, and it's a new species. That's two kinds. I think you got a baby carp. Yeah. You got a common carp. I'm gonna zoom from here. Common carp. I'm trying to avoid. No, he didn't swallow the hook. Good deal. I got him soon enough, I guess. It's about a one pound drum, if that. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <clears throat> there we go. <clears throat> Heck yeah on a worm. Large mouth. Okay, what kinds have we gotten? Two walleye, two drum, white bass carp and largemouth five kinds we've already got five kinds this is that bass that was over there that fell off earlier on my lure but not bad nice little bass guys got him on a red wiggler Say bye. Bye bye. Say bye bye, baby bass. <laughs> There's John. I actually walked across that without getting wet. He's in his kayak. Hold on one, guys. Hey, we got a new species, though. That's six kinds. I already got five kinds. That'll be six. Yeah, it looks like a short nose. Yep, short nose gar. Yeah, it is. Ooh, he's barely hooked too, man. Let me get the net. <clears throat> yeah, he's a short nose. If there's, a, I'll tell you what, I'll put him in the net so we can wash him off. Yeah. Let me uh, 
Can you hold this for me for a minute? Hey, it's a, something different anyway. I thought I was hung on the stick for a second there. <laughs> yeah. I got him right through the top of the nose. He's not coming off there. Not unless he... Unless that's an... Yeah, it's a short nose. It wouldn't be an alligator. We'll get the mud off of my finger this yeah. way. At least the worst of it. That's a cool little catch, actually. <laughs> yeah, my out. The most highly sought after species. <laughs> the short nosed gar. You got flyers? Yeah. Treasured by some, adored by none. Oh, that's good for the reels, right in the sand. Yeah, just shake them around in the sand a couple times. Yeah, it's not as bad on mine, but hers, the closed face. You gotta be careful with these pliers. They tend to cut the hooks. Got it. Oh, wow, okay. It's sticking out the side. I'll get a good photo of you. Hold it if you want. Oh, what is that the 2.5 Kitek? Yeah, 2.5, 2.8, something like it. I was nailing crappie on them down there when I had that church lake to go to. That's a cool, that was that one you had to see laying there earlier, I bet. That was right out in front? Yeah. They come over and checked us out. That's the first one I've seen this year so far. They usually ain't active yet. So cold. You come in here in June though, you're like, where'd all these come from? Remember 2012, there was thousands of them in here. All right guys, this nice little short nose gar. He's so long, I gotta back up a little bit. Cool little catch on a Kitek swim bait, two and a half inch pearl colored. They look similar to an alligator gar, the snout, but they, it's short nose. I haven't caught one of them in a while since Mingo, I think. Heck yeah, man. We caught one in the summertime. It had a big old peacock, peacock tail to it. Really colorful. Yeah, he's big around. Yeah. Good catch. Oh, <laughs> they're tough. <laughs> Why can't I get a bite on a dang worm? If there ain't a fish there, something's wrong. There we go. Oh, yeah. Nice large mouth. Woo. Yeah. There's two logs right there. You can go in between them. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. You suck. No, my big one pulls it. Stop. Don't move for a minute. All right, guys, nice little large mouth. About a pound. On a suicide shaft. up here I remember I'm lucky if I don't I know on the way back you do it's dropped so much I'll have to drag a few more places and then me along. yeah how much does that thing weigh all together uh, and mine's almost twice as heavy mine's 105 Uh, I can stand. Yeah. Be scary. I could see in a pond you'd be all right, but. All right, we shouldn't scrape right yet, but up here is going to be a challenge.
Okay, yeah, I'm gonna go to the right. Yeah, it's pretty decent. No, that's a hybrid. She got a hybrid. See it? She got a little baby hybrid. It's got the broken stripes. Sure is. You've caught two hybrids in one week. Both on accident. Yeah. I swallowed the damn hook. Hybrid. That's freaking weird. No, it swallowed the hook. Walleye. Yes. It's a bowfin. Grass carp. No, it's a grass carp. Grass carp. That's a regular grass carp. Not bad, guys. A little foot long one. <laughs> Just like that. Mm hmm. Perfect view. All right. Grass carp on a worm. It went from white bass to walleye to both in the grass carp. <laughs> you get a both in grass carp walleye. Yeah. Hybrid. Grass carp walleye hybrid. Oh man. Don't forget the worms. I got your other pole. You see all these little worm holes here? Yeah. Oh, okay. I should have took off the other week, the one you're doing. What do you got? Really? Oh, you got a red horse. You got a golden red horse. Yeah, golden red horse. That's a sucker. Them are, I like catching them though. I got 49 minutes on my, he's got a nice little golden red horse, guys. Yeah, I like their fins. It's a nice little fish though. Might have been what I was missing, maybe. Because they're kind of hard to hook. Get my phone. Take a picture of it. Where's Where the it? spider is on my bag. Un yeah, undo that. Hold oh, that okay. It's right in there. It's pretty nice out here now. 
It didn't show any sunshine today. It's supposed to be a complete overcast. Oh, John's on one. All right. I was hoping for a small mouth. Would have been 11. Hey, if it's a spotted, it is 11. Big orange eyes. It's spotted. We got 11 species, guys. We may get 16. Big old fat belly. Yeah. My God. Of 12 kinds. She got her a female bluegill. 12 species, only 15 fish. Chad just lowering it right below us here little guy but I'm happy to get anything these east winds are killing us today guys would have been a great day if it wasn't for the east wind oh man look at this back here god man there's a ton of fish back there I just know by looking at it Side. Oh man. The yeah. It... I just a bass right here. Oh, I can't even get through here. Right here. Oh my goodness. Spot out. Wow. That's exactly where I caught it, right there. I let it suck under that log just a little bit. There we go. Yep. We'll just have to go, th we just gotta go through the little woods right there. Put your hand out. <sighs> little largemouth bass guys, real little. Yeah, there's some fish over here, I can tell by looking. Yeah, that was scary up there, I'm telling you. Real little. I didn't know we was gonna come across this. I had to chase my paddle down. I might be able to get it through. It's my poles that I may have to, ouch. Yeah. Well, of all the day, oh man, I don't know what's wrong with that crankbait one. This is the most frustrating day of all of we've had. <sighs> Definitely the most work. Man, there's... Oh, I know. That's what I'm thinking. I'll definitely be wore out tomorrow. Yeah, I'm throwing in there. Throwing in there for sure. Oh, oh what do you got? Largy? Oh man, there's definitely, now I wish I had my anchor. This is a good looking hole. Oh man, it drops down to nothing. There's definitely walleye right here. It drops to 10 foot deep. Two giant boulders. Oh man, and I just went through it in a heartbeat like nothing. God, just go right through it. Route, man. You got nothing? Nothing. I even went all the way to the end. There we go. Yes. Ooh, a large maybe, the, maybe the bite's just now starting. It is 6 o'clock or 5.30. All right. All right, guys, I got me a nice spotted bass. Not bad at all on the pink pulsar. Ah, something. We have had a hell of a day. 
right when I said I was going to use worms. Now I'm going to throw the lure a couple more times. <laughs> they may just started. I know they're in here. You can just tell. It wasn't too bad. Hmm. All right, yes. What do you got? White bass. Now they're picking up. All right, dig it. All right, John got his first white bass of the day on a two and a half inch Kitek white. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty big. What is it? She's got a red horse. Hey, I'm using worms now too. Hey, that ain't that bad. All right, Wilma got her first red horse of the day. That's a big one for them. Hold it up for us. That's a big red horse. He's over a foot long. Uh, come to this side, switch sides with me. Yeah, the sun blinding me. All right, her first red horse of the day. It's in, he's about 13 inches. That's not bad. Good job. I wish it was about noon now. If it was noon, we might have some hope. She said it was small, hell, that's big for a red horse. About 14 inches. I guess she's just used to catching all them big ones this week. That's a big for a red horse though. This is a red horse sucker. Actually, I like catching them though. Like a Little sucker fish. Oh, look at that. Golden red horse. It's actually big for that kind. She said it was small, but they get a little bigger than this. But they eat, they good? Yo, yeah, they're good. I know people that gig them and purposely eat them. Yeah. Well, worms wasn't the answer either. There is no answer other than dynamite. Oh man, God. I may have caught that on film. I'm gonna send it to you in slow motion. Uh, God. Oh man, God. I may have caught that on film. I'm gonna send it to you in slow motion. Uh, <laughs>